Let me let me see if I can interview them. Hey, come on, stars. Guys, my name is Marwa. Hey, what's your name? My name is Jelinia. Jelinia, <laughs> actually, we are in Panama. It's raining a lot, like super, super. Look, man. Whoa. Welcome to Panama. Yeah, this is Panama. It's rainy season here. Look, man. Like, actually, the car is slow. If the car is, if the car is fast, you see the effect, you know. Hey, tell us about yourself, man. A little bit, just introduction. Who are you? All it's right. Basic. Um, my name is Jelinia, like I said. I'm yeah. half Panamanian, half Puerto Rican. Yeah. I used to live here actually three years ago. I moved back to Puerto Rico and I'm really happy with my island. I was born and raised over there in yeah. Puerto Rico. I have family here in Panama and I feel Panamanian as well as I feel Puerto Rican. Yeah. And I come here every year to visit friends, to visit yeah. family, and I met this great guy Marua. in the street, Marua. Yeah. Marua. Yeah. It's part of Panama in this season. Normally, when it's summer in the United States or Puerto Rico, yeah. over here it's winter time and it rains during the day, like for around two hours, sometimes three hours just in the middle of the day. Yeah. And yeah, it's part of it. But summer here is amazing. Summer for here is from February to, I think, uh, March. Yeah. I think. Yeah, and something close to that, right? Yeah. No, it's from no, it's from December to March, I think. December something like that. I, I don't know exactly, but it's the opposite of Puerto Rico. Okay. So. so let me ask you. So far, how do you feel about Panama? Comparing Panama and Puerto Rico, where where do you think it's more expensive or something well, like that? Before Panama was least expensive, but okay. now it's very Similar, oh, you know, very in similar. some, in some, in a lot of things, it's very similar. Yeah. But um, obviously, I, I, you're asking me if I like better Panama. No, in terms of cost. In terms of cost, yeah. they're almost the same. Uh -huh. They're almost the same. And yeah, there's some things here that you can probably get feel like cheaper, like a plate of food in yeah. some places or or whatever. But it's almost in rent in. Uh, Transportation, no, transportation is a little bit less. Yeah, know? right. Yeah, yeah, because of the public, public public transport. Transportation is, is, is much better than transportation here. But Puerto Rico, the good thing about Puerto Rico is the beautiful beaches, that yeah. everything is so close. The food is amazing. Panama, the same. People are very nice, very humble. Yeah. And um, you have rivers here, but everything is a little bit far from the city. So in Puerto Rico, at least everything is like closer around. Okay, yeah, because it's a small island. Exactly. Yeah. Versus here, you have to go to inside of Panama, yeah. that is what people call El Interior. Oh, Interior. And, <laughs> and over there, you're going to see beautiful spaces, beautiful yeah. beaches, beautiful farms, beautiful yeah. rivers, and beach. And it's, it's, it's a different thing, but it's still lovely. It's still yeah. lovely. Where do you feel more Latina? Where do you feel more Latina? Puerto Rico or Panama? Wow, I feel like the vibe. Let me tell you something. I yeah. feel super Latina because both places, Panama and Puerto Rico, are like in here they love salsa more sometimes yeah. than even the Puerto Ricans themselves. Like I feel like Latina every. I feel Latina here. I feel Latina in Puerto Rico. Like, oh. Yeah, I feel <laughs> in both places. But there's not, there's not much you Over feeling. there in Puerto Rico with the reggaeton. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and yeah. You know, actually, so actually Puerto Rico is like the father of music in Latin America. If you talk about musicians or reggaeton, especially, I mean, music, reggaeton, I have to be very categorical. It's like it's taking over. It's taking over everywhere, everywhere in the world. And it's amazing, all these artists coming from Puerto Rico. All of these artists coming from Puerto Rico yeah. getting together to defend the island. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's amazing what music has has done to yeah, the island. Yeah. But the island has that. The island has that 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 scene that a lot of artists come out of it. Wait, do, do you feel sometimes of like uh, the bad situations in Puerto Rico, like uh, 
the hurricane. Do you feel like you can't like invest in Puerto Rico because maybe one day your investment can go or no, what do you think? No, I've been living in Puerto Rico almost my entire life. Yeah. And the people that are there will leave Puerto Rico not because fearing the the, the hurricane. The hurricane. Yeah. It's more because fearing the fact that economically we've been suffering because okay. of government yeah. bad decisions. But yeah. Everybody in Puerto Rico loves Puerto Rico. Like it's a place that you just feel so beautiful and you feel energized by nature. And, okay. and I don't. There's there's no reason why I should complain about the place. Only the fact that things are not going good economically. But yeah. we're gonna get better. We're gonna get better. Actually, I loved a lot Puerto Rico when I was there. I just it's one of my favorite places to stay in the U.S. Like if I have to choose a place to live in a U.S. territory territory I mean it's gonna be Puerto Rico let me ask you can you give me like three tips of coming to Panama like if somebody wants his or her life to be easy in Panama and nice and enjoy good time and you know meet people how 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 can that happen well um, just uh, a general advice maybe let's think of this let me get out of the box because remember that when I come here I come and stay with my family that that's yeah. a huge help yeah but other than that basically just feel like a local just always when you travel and I know that you do yeah, this yeah, yeah, do. just feel like a local go and eat where Panamanian people eat yeah go in and and, 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 and and go dance to a place that is safe of course yeah. but that normally Panamanian people are dancing as well yeah and that's what it normally is gonna help you to enjoy a place that you're yeah. not from there you just meet with the people that live there and you get advice you 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 listen and and you then act and can get advice of different places you, when you come to panama you need to visit san blas it's san a blas. beautiful yeah, actually, island i'm going i'm going there after this well yeah, you yeah. are a lucky guy it's a beautiful place <laughs> yeah. very exotic yeah go to and uh, you can go and 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 eat some patacones with yeah, patacone. fried fish. Yeah. You need to do that when you come here. Yeah. Uh, you need to go to Casco Viejo, walk around old Casco Viejo. It's a beautiful place with really nice restaurant clubs, bars. Yeah, actually that's where we met, in Casco Viejo. We yeah. met in Casco Viejo. Yeah. In a party. In, let me tell you something, in Casco Viejo you start meeting people and you, you, you guys can make plans to do all yeah, this yeah, stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. And the cool. Chiriqui. I've never been there, but oh, everybody tells me that it's beautiful. Yeah. David, it's like very far away, but yeah. it's something that you should come and do. There's islands that you can go, Taboga, Conta, eh, no, eh, Contadora, it's, I don't know if it's Contadora, that's an island. Yeah, I, I don't know more yeah, of Contadora, the Contadora and Taboga, those yeah. are beautiful islands. Um, go around the city, Casco Viejo, go yeah. to the Panama Canal, very oh, yeah, important. Panama. Coming here is, and basically, this place is beautiful because I feel like if I wasn't Puerto Rico, people are very interaction. Oh, oh. so it feels more Puerto Rican here. Yeah, it feels people. It's a culture, Latin culture, you know. Yeah, yeah. I love Latin culture a lot, and I always tell my subscribers I will end up living in one of these countries. Yeah, like just here in Latin America, you know. You wanna live. It, it Somewhere, yeah, 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 yeah. Every month in a different one. <laughs> yeah, that will be my dream, but What's I say your like. favorite until now? So far is Colombia. Colombia? What yeah. part of Colombia you went? I went nearly to all cities in Colombia. Wow, I love it. Before I lived there for two years. Oh, nice. Yeah. Where? Where do you live in Colombia? In Medellin and, oh, nice. and Bogota. Oh, nice. Yeah. <laughs> I've never been to Colombia. I want to go to Colombia. It's so close from here. It's 45 minutes, you know? Yeah. yeah. Oh, 45 minutes in yeah. the plane. In the plane. Yeah, nice. Yeah, nice, it's nice, super nice, close. Nice. Okay, say so your last words as you end the video. Just something, Yanni. Something to end up a video. Well, I want to say everybody always do the right thing yeah. have your heart and your conscious clean yeah love each other pray have good energy yeah. positivity yeah positivity. and take care of you and the people around you yeah Peace. Man. hey thank you guys for watching this video i'll see you in my next one she's from puerto rico that's the vibe you can get in puerto rico and go to puerto rico <laughs> actually last time i was there it was really amazing it's one of those place, places where I flew out feeling like I shouldn't leave, you know, I was like, no, I needed one more week to stay here, but 
Yeah, okay, ciao ciao, we shall see you next time. Ciao. Bye. Bye. Take care. Yeah. Oh yeah. What's up, what's up guys? What's up guys, uh, my name is Marwa, if it's your first time to this YouTube channel, can you subscribe? I'm here in Casco Viejo, Panama. It's my second time to be here again, I mean this year. And uh, cars are really flowing as you see them. It's a very chill environment, music playing from all sides. so close you know let me let me see if i can interview them hey how much stars todo bien mama